Hello and welcome to norod4u.com. This presentation is about ELF magnetic field from hybrid car. This video is filmed using a smartphone in airplane mode. The measurement in this video are for ELF magnetic field. Please also measure ALF radiation. The measurements were done when the car engine was running, but the car was not moving. While driving the car, the levels might be higher than appear in this video. Back chair, right side. Magnetic field between 10 to 30 milligauss with pulse over 100 milligauss. On the front passenger seat, levels between 4 and 10 milligauss. Near the feet of the front passenger over 25 milligauss. Pay attention to the street background levels, which are lower than 2 milligauss. Over the lower side frame, probably where the, there are power wires and cables going back to the batteries. Levels between 4 to 10 milligauss when pushing the gas pedal over 100 milligauss. Near the pedals, over 10 milligauss. On the driver's seat, between 2 to 5 milligauss. Actually, this is the best place in the car to sit in. Pay attention to the street background levels, which are lower than 2 milligauss. Back chair, right side. Magnetic field between 10 to 30 milligauss with pulse over 100 milligauss. I hereby call the car industry. Stop hiding behind high non-protective EMF standards. Make a requirement for all your products to be low EMF, lower than 2 milligauss all around the car. I believe that if designed correctly, this requirement can be met very easily. Produce low EMF car, low magnetic field and low RF emission, meaning that all RF sources can be turned completely off. Until that will happen, I recommend people who are aware of the possible health risk of low level EMF exposure to test their cars, both for ELF magnetic field and RF radiation, if possible, before buying it, especially if you are an electromagnetic hypersensitive person. Please note that high ELF and RF levels can exist both in electric, hybrid, gas, petrol or diesel car. So be sure to test them for yourself. Thanks for watching and see you next time.